Hi everybody, this is Titi Readings and today this reading is going to be for Pisces. Pisces, this is a bonus message for you, okay, bonus reading for you. So yeah, that's about it. I don't know how else to put it. Um, yeah, there is going to be an extended version of this. So if this video resonates with you, you can check out the extended version for more details. In the extended, we're going to clarify more about your person, the outcome of the situation, advice, love notes, all that. So you can watch that if you're interested. This one's going to be for Pisces. Let's see, what are the bonus messages for Pisces? And this reading is going to be timeless. So there's no like time limit. You can watch if you're a Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. I'm mainly reading only for Pisces. So if you're a cross watcher, this could resonate with you if you're here. But this reading is focused on the sign. So I would recommend you check out your sign, the cross watcher. Anyway, you can watch if you like. So, what are the messages that we have for Pisces? La Shapo. Okay, Pisces, let's see. What are the messages for you? Okay, we're going to see. Five of Cups flew out in the reverse, which is beautiful, beautiful energy. Uh, this energy to me is, um, is like you getting over something. Um, I feel like you're letting go of the past hurt or you're letting go of a situation which was very hurtful. Okay. Bottom of the deck, we have the Two of Swords followed by the Tower. Okay. So Pisces is very, very focused on their money. Pisces is very, very focused on their stability, okay? Overall stability. That is your money. That is your emotional self. That is your, um, of course, your environment. I don't know, whatever the case might be. I see a lot of you planning to buy something big or to move stability-wise, you know, um go somewhere get a better job or get a better house or change i don't know i just feel like pisces there was a situation that was um really really tough for you and you went through that time where i know there's only one card here but i can read okay <laughs> so let me talk uh <laughs> I feel like Pisces, there was a situation where you suffered and you suffered for quite some time and then you decided that no, it's enough. It's enough. Enough is enough. What am I doing? Literally like a wake up call. So that is beautiful. That is waking up. That is awakening. That is realizing what you are here for. Some of you are realizing your true purpose. Some of you are becoming more just being very self-aware and being aware of the things around you, okay? Could be dealing with the Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, or Scorpio, Aries. Yeah, I feel like somebody here was walking away from another person. Could be you or them. But you also decided to walk away, right? Pisces. I literally see a lot of you traveling. I literally see traveling for a lot of Pisces or some of you could be trying to travel. Somebody that you're cutting out of your life. Um, you're very determined to cut somebody out of your life and go on a new path. And the reason why you want to go on a new path is because somebody was making you feel left out. Somebody was making you feel not that good about yourself so then you decided that i'm going to be in control of my life right now i just see you um 
viewing the situation as a disaster waiting to happen and it's like you don't even want to deal with it okay ace of swords pisces you could be dealing with a libra gemini or aquarius okay um this is that clarity this is that new beginning this is that you know um the one that i was talking about you know the kind of an idea that you know you feel like enough is enough kind of an energy here pisces with the ace of swords i feel like a lot of you are focused on new beginnings okay so you're letting go of the past patterns and deciding to change things and change things for the better okay four of wands pisces tell me tell me what is this um this is stability this is um home this is um feeling good feeling prosperous um feeling balanced some of you pisces really want to start a family some of you want to get married okay look at that four of ones it's, it's beautiful okay i do feel like um that is what you want in a relationship marriage you want stability you don't want people to be playing games with you and you're very clear on that you're very clear on that um some of you are literally saving up to buy a new house literally or move towards your stability is what i see hermit oh damn <laughs> i dropped it so pisces somebody made you feel really left out somebody neglected you we have two new beginnings here already so somebody neglected you somebody made you feel like you were an option to them and pisces you like i said you stayed there for a while and then you realize that it's not worth it for me to stay here so some of you i see you separating yourself from people i see you contemplating a lot i see you thinking a lot um and i feel like what what you have um decided is that you're going to be focusing on new and better things for yourself um a better outcome okay um a better situation for yourself okay um i do feel like pisces um there are new beginnings on the horizon for you look at that okay i strongly feel like there is something new coming up for you um and you're very much interested you're very much interested i feel like these days you're putting a lot of work and effort into your passion and trying to follow where your heart is but at the same time bringing logic into it as well okay i feel like your life uh has been going through a lot of changes lately too many cards too many cards we're gonna take them yeah you're moving towards your stability we have four 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 pisces four four and four how do I put them together? Oh, I suck at this. Okay. So now you can see. Oh, you still can't see. Never mind. Yes, now you can see. We have 444. Four, four. <laughs> um, stability. Uh, I feel like Pisces, you're finally taking control. Because, yeah, you're, you're finally taking control back. And this is you holding back from a situation where you were feeling neglected. And now you are putting your attention and energy elsewhere some of you are starting a new business maybe some of you are focused more on the money side of you know on the money side i don't know some of you are focused more on the money but i do feel like uh pisces you are learning lessons and i feel like you are a lot of you are uh distancing yourself from the 
from the mess or the crowd, I would say, to contemplate. And I feel like um, a lot of you are realizing a lot of things. Um, and it's like you being like, you know, when you get that feeling like, oh, damn, really? That's the kind of a feeling that you are getting. And you, I feel like self-love and just prioritizing yourself is what you are focused on. Um, because with a person, there was a situation that bothered you so bad, Pisces. Like it really, it really hurt you. And now you feel like you've gone through enough already. Now you don't. You, you just don't, don't want to put yourself through that again. Okay. Right. Wow. We have the lovers at the bottom of the deck with the nine of ones. Again, so I do see that there uh, there is a, a deep connection between you and somebody. But I feel like the person that you were dealing with was probably the one who was holding back in the past. Okay, the person that you were dealing with. But then I feel like now you are closing off as well because you feel like, you know, I better focus on new things, new beginnings. You know, I haven't got time for this. So that's the kind of energy that I get for you because with that four of wands, the ace of wands and the ace of swords, this is literally like... Um, you focusing on new beginnings okay this is you focusing on what makes you happy what makes you feel good within yourself which is really good okay good night of ones pisces this person is not going to leave you alone. The Queen of Pentacles. See? So I feel like you're cutting this person out. You're being like, nope, I've given you enough already. Like, what are you here for? But I do see uh, them coming towards you. But Pisces, um, it's like somebody coming in towards you and you totally being like, this person has nothing to offer. I know. Like, you see through them. You see right through them. Like... <laughs> You're not going to be fooled again. You're focused on your stability. And I don't think you're going to be very giving into the situation anymore. Because your feelings, you know, something has changed within you, Pisces. Tell me if it's right. Okay, do let me know in the comments. Because I feel like something has changed here drastically. And the way you are moving forward with the kind of energy, that's amazing. Um... So we do have the Knight of Wands. Um, that is somebody coming in towards you. Okay. Um, so look at that. I do see somebody coming in towards you. But I also feel like you want, you want this person to be more truthful. Uh, you are like, if this person wants another chance, if this person wants to start this again with me, they better be honest they better be um truthful they better tell me the truth and then i will give them a chance otherwise i feel like you got your own thing going on i don't see you focusing on them even if you are thinking about them it's not as much as you used to Or maybe you, you still think a lot about them, but the way you are looking at the situation has changed. Six of Wands being your overall outcome. Um, so Pisces, you are headed towards growth. You're headed towards stability. I even see marriage for a lot of you, but I see it not very, like, not in the near future, but there could be marriage. Um... There are new beginnings. So those new beginnings could result in a more stable relationship maybe. But this is looking like victory. This is looking like success. This is looking like all that you've been wanting, Pisces. Like, look at that. Like, how do I put it so you can see? Right? This is what you really have been wanting. And this is what's coming in in your life. I feel like, Pisces, your money is going to be really good. And I just see you being successful. I just see if, if you've been wanting to buy a house... 
like I said before, it's going to be very good for you. I feel like it's going to be very prosperous for you. Um, or if you're saving up to buy something big or you're starting a new project, something is going to be very good for you. Okay, Pisces. Um, I just see you feeling good about yourself. Ten of Wands. This situ oh, this person's gonna be back, Pisces. But I feel like the situation has burdened you. This person has burdened you. Okay. For some of you, this does look like maybe this person was already in a relationship, or they have other things that they were focused on, and that's why they were not very giving into the relationship with you. But whatever the case might be, now you are focused on yourself and new beginnings. Okay, I like it. Let's pick some romance angel oracles for you. Let's see. Children, maybe some of you have a child with this person or have children or want children or you're spending time with children. Trust have trust pisces trust the process okay because it's taking you somewhere where you're meant to be free yourself and forgiving and learning i feel like you really need to release past burdens which you are doing and i feel like you need to be more trusting of the process and yourself as well to be able to see what's next you know in your life and free yourself from anything that burdens you that gives you trust issues because i do feel like this person has given you many many trust issues but the more you let go and free yourself the more you will find that it's easier for you to attract um what it is that you truly want in your life to be honest okay anyway that's about it pisces those were the messages that popped out for you i hope you enjoyed this reading Give this video a like and subscribe to my channel if it resonated with you. You can check out the extended version of this link down below. We're going to have a look at your person a bit. Who is coming towards you and what is this new beginning that is, you know, that popped out in this reading with the Ace of Wands and the Ace of Swords. Um, and we're also going to pick out advice or cool messages for you. So if you would like, you can check that reading out. It's a timeless reading. So whenever you watch, it can resonate. Okay. Thank you so much for being here. Take care and bye-bye.